Caitlin and welcome to a new vlog. It is Saturday and I just got home from Costco to pick up some more Christmas things. I got some new tea towels, I got ribbons, some uh, new wine packages, and then I also bought some garland for my railing. I have a few places to put this which I've got two longer sections so this is leading from my first floor obviously to my second i've got some smaller areas here where the garland is going to be too long to fit uh, but i'm still going to try to figure out if i can put ribbon or something else kind of fun there and then upstairs i've also got this obviously this long section and then the shorter one here so i just wanted to say welcome to a new vlog and let's put up some garland <laughs> first part is done there's also uh, different settings for if you want like colored lights or white lights or a mix of both or them blinking or something like that which I thought was really cool I did not know that when I bought them but I think they're pretty and also I love Christmas time I think they're so fun hello and happy Sunday I'm just having a few friends over, so I just put out some plates. I've got some stuff in the oven, and then I love this. I picked this up at Home Goods and just put a bottle of champagne in there. And I've also got my new uh, red wine glasses that I also picked up from Home Goods. I also finished my uh, putting up the garland on my railing, so you can see them. Everything else is clean and looks. Uh, pretty good before everyone gets here. I turned on my little cheer sign and then you can see some more garland I've got here and then going up the stairs. So yeah, happy Sunday. Good morning. It is Tuesday. I'm heading out to Maryland for a conference for the day, but I just wanted to check in. I'm just wearing a black blazer, this little sweater that I've shown you before, and just some black pants. I just got to Maryland for a conference. Those that live in Maryland hate to go to Virginia because the traffic is so bad in the morning and vice versa. So I have certainly fought my fair share of traffic this morning, but it should be a pretty good day. Luckily, it's just a couple of hours and then I head back home, uh, get some more work done. And I'm also gonna try to get my eyebrows done today because those desperately need to be done. And I wanna check yet another thing off my list before I leave for Paris next week. After like five hours of driving today, all before 1 p.m., I'm finally back in Virginia and ready to get my eyebrows done. I have to admit, I'm not very good at keeping up with them and shaping them and all that stuff, so it feels really good when I get them all done and refreshed, uh, hoping that I can do a little bit of a better job next time. But for the last two years, I've gotten my eyebrows done by doing threading. For years, I used to do waxing around the same time that I would get my nails done. It was right before one of my best friend's weddings. I was in the wedding and I got my eyebrows done the day before and the wax was too hot that it burnt off my skin and it was just a mess like the pictures I still look back and I can tell that like something's off up here even with all the makeup uh, that they try to help kind of cover it up but Essentially, since then, I have not gotten that done, and I've done um, threading, which I think is much better, and I actually think it's much more precise as well. So I will be right back once I have that done. And I'm all done. I just finished. I think my eyebrows look so much better, and I just feel so much better now that they're done. Oh my gosh, I finally got my hands on the Skims and Savarsky uh, collaboration that they just released. I was mostly interested in the bodysuits and the ones I typically like to wear a black bodysuit, sometimes I may do the tan, but I really liked both of these in black and I need to show you what they look like. The first one is the kind of tank version, right? I think the details and the crystals on these are just so pretty and perfect for the holiday season. It then obviously extends on the back as well but I'm obsessed with that. And then my second one, obviously because we're in the winter months now, 
I wanted this in the long sleeve as well. So again, same thing, the crystals go down the sleeves, but I definitely think I'm gonna bring this one on my New York trip. I'm just so excited to wear these. I absolutely love them. I'm also heading to the office for a couple of hours today, and then a couple of us are heading to this event for Women in IT. That's in Reston Town Center. It's actually at the Speakeasy that I went to a couple of weeks ago, so it should be pretty fun. And then on Friday, I'm going to get my nails redone, and this will be the final time that I get them done before I head to Paris next week. So I have to figure out if I wanna do something like really festive, or if I just wanna keep it like classy. Uh, so I don't know. I don't know yet, but I'm excited to always get that done And then I'm also going to pick up some new teeth whitening trays from my dentist as well because they're both kind of in the same area And I've been doing that for about eight months now, and it's been a really great experience I will talk to you a little bit more about that on Friday, but I'm super excited Skims packages just came in. I love the packaging. Again, I got the Naughty and Nice socks and then I got two pairs of pajamas and I just wanted to show you what they look like. So this is the first one. I got it in this icy blue color and this is the long sleeve t-shirt dress. You can see you've got this up here. Um, I love the color, it's long sleeve, and again, just kind of like a t-shirt dress with buttons down the center of it. Um, I think this will be super cute, especially if you pair them with these socks that I'll open up in a minute. Uh, and then here's the second one. This is what the second one looks like. Again, I got it in this icy blue color. Uh, it is just, oh my god, these look so comfortable. I just got them in, again, the long sleeve uh, t-shirt that looks similar to the little dress. And then I got these long pants as well. What I really liked about these is I have the regular Skims pajamas and I absolutely love them. But what interested me in is that these are made out of silk or a silk-like material. They get really hot at night. And I think a fabric like this like to the touch feels very cooling so that you don't overheat at night. So I'll have to let you know what like, my first night goes and these, but I just wanted a couple of different options. Again, I love the current Skims pajamas that I have. So when they came out with some new ones, I was certainly very interested. And of course we can't forget about the socks. I love that it comes with two pairs. Actually, I guess that makes sense. Uh, one that say naughty and the other one that say nice. These feel so thick. I think they're so cute. I love that it says skims at the bottom. But yeah, I feel like you can either just wear like one or the other, or I think it would be fun to like mix and match as well. But yeah, these are what I got and I really love them. I just settled down for the night and I decided to wear my new Skims pajamas to try them out. I went with the two piece set to the long sleeve top and then I'm also wearing the long sleeve pants and my new socks as well. Everything is super comfortable so far. The pajamas are actually like a really good mix of warm and breathable at the same time. I'm not like overheating so far and obviously we'll see how it is tonight but it's I'm, I'm really enjoying them. They're super soft and it always feels so good to put on a new and fresh pair of pajamas. So I'm just going to enjoy the rest of my night, but I did want to update you on that. And yeah, super cute. Happy Friday. Today is the day that I get my nails redone before I head out for Paris next week. I'm leaning towards like a sparkly green or sparkly red. We'll see, sometimes my nail uh, person has a lot of just different random cool ideas. So she might do something different, but that's kind of what I'm thinking so far. And then I'm also stopping by to get some more teeth whitening from my dentist. I use uh, teeth whitening trees and 
and in the beginning you use them like a little bit more often to get your kind of teeth used to it and to just brighten them faster and then now I think I use it like twice a week and when I'm working from home or sitting down and watching some TV for you know or just doing things around the house I'll pop them in and they can be in for you know a couple of hours they can be in for a shorter amount of time but there's usually between like six and eight syringes of the teeth whitening that come in a box and so too expensive to have your teeth whitening in for like an hour uh, especially when I only do it like twice a week so I usually have them in between four and five hours and then if your teeth start to feel too sensitive then I just take them out. I tried, you know, the normal teeth whitening that you can pick up from Walmart or wherever for a little while back. And my teeth and gums are just too sensitive for that. And I've tried it, I've tried different brands and they just tore up my mouth and I was just in pain for days after. So I went to my dentist and that's kind of how I came across this and it's worked out really well. I think you always feel better when you're, you know, whenever your nails are done, your hair is done and your teeth are brighter. I am gonna continue to keep that up as uh, long as I can, but I'm also gonna be doing that today. And then this afternoon, I'm going to see the new Hunger Games movie uh, with a couple of friends. I'm so excited. I love the Hunger Games. I am not going to lie. I started to read this new uh, book like years ago when it came out because it goes backwards, right? When um, President Snow, I guess the first Hunger Games. So I don't know. I, I started reading it. I'm not going to lie. I'm not a big reader, so I didn't get that far into it. My sister read it. She thought it was really good and now the movie's out so I will be going to go see the movie and I hope it's really good there's a lot of hype around it but yeah I'm doing that and then I'm just gonna kind of go through the rest of my weekend but I will probably end the vlog here I will show you what I end up getting on my nails in the next vlog and then I might do some a little bit of like packing prep and with you as well on what I'm thinking of bringing to Paris but thank you so much for watching don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I'll see you soon